Well, hello, welcome back to my channel. It's Salisa coming to you from Beautifully Me and You. De Belamente y Tu y Yo. And y'all see everything on the table. It's time to do some savings challenges, okay? <laughs> I have a little bit of extra cash and I was like, you know what? I'm gonna do some savings challenges with that money and I'll explain to you how I got it and how it all came about. But yeah, if that sounds like something that interests you, seeing me stuff some cash into some savings challenges on Vlogmas Day 4? Then let's get right into the video. Oh no, oh wait, it's Vlogmas day five. On Vlogmas day five, then let's get right into the video. guys before we get started we do need to pick a winner from yesterday's vlogmas day four so hold on one second let me get my little computer set up and then i'll be right back all right you guys i got it all set up and for yesterday's video let's see what did we have to do i forgot let me see oh we had to put hashtag cheer in order to be possibly entered to win siri had picked 59 dollars, and you guys you got a strong chance of winning this one i'm gonna tell you why not many people watch because it was Phineas and Fiona's trip to the bank. And so that's just not as like hype. So the real ones showed up at the building and put hashtag cheer and yeah. So you guys got a strong chance of winning this one. All right, let's see what it is. Hashtag cheer, who's gonna win? The winner is Michelle Peoples. Hey, Michelle, hashtag cheer. That's right, girlfriend, you won $59. Please reach out to me over on Instagram or either in the email down below so I can get your prize right over to you. Y'all, she did that. So let's talk about what tomorrow's giveaway will be. It will be two items from my Etsy store. And so, yeah, I decided to go back to that because that's like really a cool prize and it's, it's good. I just, I like to give back. And you guys will see some of my shop items here today in this video. So yeah, keep your eye out for something you might possibly want. And let's see, we'll embed the hashtag somewhere within the video. And as long as you watch and you comment the hashtag, that will be your entry ticket, okay? Two items minus my Scratch and Save Skipper Double Book. We're not gonna be giving that one away, but anything else in the shop, two particular items you could pick. Last thing we need to discuss is the fifth day of Christmas. Y'all, this is the big one. Okay, we already did four calling birds three French hens, two turtle doves. And y'all, I had some more submi submissions, submissions, get it out. I had some more submissions for the um, 12 days of Christmas and you guys are just out here singing and everything. Wait till you guys see. I don't want to give too much away because it is so cute. Singing with your kids and everything. But let me shout out who um, sent me a whole day's worth. Hold on one second. Oh my God, okay. Sorry, y'all. I'm sorry. I'm back. Okay. I just had another submission from Lynn. Hey, Lynn. You're so cute. Okay, look. Shayna, she sent me a submission. Rose sent me a submission. Y'all out here singing it up. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, now we come to the big day. Five, on the fifth day, come on. Everybody know what he got on the fifth day. Five golden rings. So, on the fifth day of Christmas, my true love gave to me five golden rings. Four calling birds, three French hens, two turtle doves, and a partridge in a pear tree. That's the whole day. But if you want to just get up to the five golden rings, I will take it. Okay, thank you guys so much. You guys have like, you guys bring so much smile and joy to my face. I don't have a little ring on, but if I did, it would be blue right now. Because I am in such a good mood behind this little Christmas song. <laughs> and seeing, I just opened it and I happened to see Lynn's submission. Hey, Lynn. <laughs> okay, let's get back on track. What are we here to do today? We are here to cash stuff some money that my sister gave back to me. So first of all, if you guys have been here for a while, then you already know that um, I my car's engine got busted, right? And so my engine was blown in my Ford Edge. We're not even going to go back there. That's going to upset me. Okay, we're not going to go back there. Okay, so, but the true blessing was that I was able to pick up my mom's car, a Honda Insight, and that's what I drive now. Um, but the car ended up having like some bald tire issues and I mean craziness out of nowhere. Like I said, I went to go get it serviced. If you've been here for a while, I'm just giving the people that haven't been here the backstory. 
I went to get the car serviced. It had two ball tires that had tread showing. It literally could have flew off at any moment. So I had to emergently get four new tires, okay? So I used my car maintenance fund and took some money out of there and went ahead and got the four new tires. But my sister, out of the kindness of her heart, since she had been driving on the car awaiting her Tesla, said that she would help me with the tires. So she wanted to give me back cash and she gave me $250 and that is could be going back into the car maintenance fund but it's more fun to put it in savings challenges it's probably going to be reallocated anyway so let's talk about <laughs> how, uh, what denominations i have and let's go ahead and count it up 51 20 40 60 82 to 10 20 30 35 40 45 250 $250 cash tray enters the room um yeah so i'm just gonna put this in some savings challenges and you know keep it pushing um, of course, if my car breaks down and I need some help with the inside, I will definitely be getting some money out of one of these savings challenges anyway. So yeah, I'm going to do a whole video on what I think about savings challenges and what they're useful for. So you can expect that sometime probably through the weekend. But for right now, let's go ahead and step this money into some savings challenges. First and foremost is the Easy Mini Cash Budget, 1,000 or less savings challenge planner. I created this planner. It has over 30 savings challenges in it. Now there is a larger form as well, and they're for sale on Amazon. I'll put a video up here comparing all the planners that I've created that are for sale on Amazon. So if you're looking for a planner for 2023, savings challenges, or just a regular planner, go ahead and head down to my Amazon storefront after you check out the video to see which one's best for you, and you can purchase directly through that link. All right, let's see what I've been doing. You guys, I am going to come out with some new planners and it should hopefully be before the new year. I thought it would be this week, but I got something else on behind the scenes working on. I think you guys already know what it is. All right. So let's talk about putting the puzzle together. This one, I like to ask Siri for a multiplier. And since my phone's about to die per usual, I live on 1%, literally. Um, since my phone's about to die, <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and ask Siri for a multiplier between one and nine. Hey, Siri. Can you please give me a random number between one and nine, please? A random number between one and nine is nine. You can't play with Siri, because just when you think she ain't going to play with you, she ain't going to do you wrong, here she come with a nine. We ain't got a lot to play with today. Siri, I only have $250. Please, please, stop it. All right, I had some markers just beyond the bulb, so I'm going to color this one yellow, and this will be $90. Let me get my binder. All right, you guys, so putting the puzzle together, I'm gonna to be putting $90 in there today. Let's go ahead and put a 50 and two 20s. I might be risky with that move, but I don't think it's that much in here because I had, condi oh, lovely. There's only 150, so I won't have to count any odd, weird numbers. So we're gonna put 90 in there for today. And now for putting the puzzle together, I have 1,000, 51, 20, 40, 60, 82, 230. So $1,230. Should I go again? Nah, uh, yeah, let's try one more. The daredevil in me makes me do it. Hey Siri, can you please give me a random number between one and nine, please? A random number between one and nine is two. Aw, it's like she heard me talking about her and she know I can't do big. Thank you, Siri. All right, we're gonna color this one blue. And let me do this one, do, 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 do. Put another $20. You guys, look what the Fitbit did to my wrist. Do you see that? It's a total rash right here. And it got on the sides. You can't really see it, but... <sighs> Fitbit don't want me to be healthy. Okay, <laughs> 1,051, 20, 40, 60, 82 to 20, 30, no, 20, 40, 50. Okay, $1,250 for putting the puzzle together. I'm really trying to get this one done, but y'all, I mean, the way Siri throwing out numbers, I got a lot left to do. We're gonna consider this one done for today though. All right. <laughs> okay, the next thing we're gonna do is the $400 Scratch and Save Challenge, um, the character edition. So there's this side for $400 and there's this side for $250. This is a double-sided challenge and it really is pretty cool. Um, if you hit a character, then you have to double the amount that you scratch next. But if you don't hit it, and there's one special character that says friends forever somewhere embedded in here. And if you hit that one, then you can pick whatever amount you want to save. Okay. But I'm going to scratch one and we'll go from there. Let's try this one. Ah! I 
thought it might be something right there. I don't know why my eye was drawn towards this one. Okay, well, that's okay. That's a cute little panda. So we need to double whatever comes next. Let's try this one. My eye was on this one too. 21 is not bad at all. So that means I need to put $42. I don't have any ones. And I was putting that into this first um, envelope up here. Let's see. And I don't think I have any ones. No sir, we bought. Let me see. What's in spring break? Nope. There's no ones in there either. Okay. So we're just going to put 45 then. And right now I have 20, 40, 60, 65, 70. And I don't know what I'm going to be using this towards. So yeah, right now we're gonna add 45 though. That'll be 20, 40, 60, 81, 1, 5, 10, 15, 1, 15. This might actually be going towards some skims I'm trying to get. Y'all keep saying, you ain't got them skims yet. I have a problem spending money, not saving it. I There's $42 and I ended up putting 45. So we're all good for this scratch and save challenge. All right, so what do we have left you ask? Let's see, 50, 60, 70, 80. $95. Okay. Well, you know, I'm trying to get these scratch and saves done and I only have one side left of one double-sided card to do. So let's work on this one a little bit. This is the scratch and save skipper double challenge, the mini edition. And on this side is 350 and this side was 500. I also have one that is 75 and 200. Uh, 300 and 400 and then 100 and 250. So they come in different varieties of dollar amounts based on your income. I need to complete the rest of this 350 side and then I can go ahead and reallocate this money elsewhere. All right, so let's see what we're gonna come across. I think I'm gonna go right under the 50. Ooh, this one coming in super hot. Okay, $40, that's not a lot. But that's a lot when I only got 90. Okay, so let's see what we got. 10, 20, 30, 35, 40. All right, we got $55 left. Let's go ahead and get that in here. Um, let's see. More tens for this envelope, huh? Okay. More tens. This one needs a super duper condensing. Let me see, five, six, 657, 20, 40, 60, 88, 20, 40, 60, 89, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 10, that's 1,000, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 91, 10, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 41, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. I think I said 1249. It's either 11 or 1249, but you know, when I got lost with that 10 and five, y'all, things just left my mind. Sometimes things just leave my mind. That was one of the times. So I think it's, <laughs> I think it's 1149, but it could be 12. This envelope is giving me so much problems. Hold on. Oh, there we go. Bill condensing, dude. Like I need to do, if nothing else, just that one little envelope to get it right. Okay, what else can we do in this binder? Fifty-five dollars. Fifty-five. I hardly have anything left in Christmas, y'all. I've been spending, but I'm almost done shopping. Fifty-five dollars. Flower scratch off. Let's do one in the winter challenge. The blue marker is on the table for a reason. Oh, but I took the money out of here. Okay, we'll do two. No, because I want to do the scratch and save book. Let's not do this one. I want to do the scratch and save skipper double book. And if I have $55, I feel like I can get some things taken care of. So hold on. All right, this is a Scratch and Save Skipper Double Challenges book edition. There are several challenges in this book, um, several pages, different varying dollar amounts. When you complete the whole book, you will have saved $8,000 and um, or more, right? Because if you hit a Skipper Double and you double the amount, you will have more than $8,000. You can have upwards of $10,000 for this book. So for me, I've been working on page one, which I completed, page two and three. And with $55, we are headed to page three because this one says all the scratch off on this page is between 20 and 50. 
I have my new little UK penny. Let's scratch something on this side. How about, let's go right here. Okay, not bad at all. I will take that, that's 34. I dare not scratch this side again because there's a, there is a $20 somewhere on there, but I might not hit it. So we're going to do 34 from that side. And we're going to flip over here where it's between 1 and 14. We know we probably won't go over unless we hit a skip or double. In that case, we would be skipping. Okay. Yay. $4 plus the 34 we have, well, plus the 34 on this side is 38. Let's see if we could do another one. I'm being a little risky out here. Uh, ooh, that one? Okay. Oh my gosh, I cannot believe it. Okay, wait a minute. I have 38 plus 7 is 45. 45 and I have 55? Should I try one more? What do y'all think? Am I going to end up with an IOU? Let's try one more. This one. date taking daredevil moves and it'd be working out though okay so i had 38 plus 7 was 45 plus 1 is 46 and i don't have any change but we're gonna see what's in that binder for the um flower challenge book 46 see you know what sometimes you gotta take the big risks in life and guess what it works out 46 hmm 47 48 49 50 see look at that take four out and put 50 in and let's see what we got in the flower scratch off. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 50, 1,000. 20, 40, 60, 70, 80. 1,080 dollars. Y'all, I'm going to be doing this one all next year until we get to the end of this. And I feel like I want to finish that in 2023. So that's that. And I don't know why I button this because I need to find the home of these $9. And you already know where I'm going. If you've been here before, I'm going right over here to spring break. And I'm going to put it in the Let's Save More Challenge. Now, let me get the markers. All right. So, I have $9 to put in. And we already have five, six, seven. So, for $9, I have my little gold marker for this one. For $9, I'm going to put hmm, five, nine, how am I going to do this? Let's think about this. I think I'm gonna do a five on this side. This side's colorful, so we're gonna put a five. And then this side, we need to do four. I wish I had one more dollar. See, okay, wait. Now I'm regretting that last scratch. I should have left it alone. But anyway, now <laughs> I have four dollars. I'm gonna color in four ones. So there's one, two, three and four. All right, so I colored in four of them from this side. This is called the Let's Save More, but when, on Etsy it's called Steps to Save because it is a double side challenge. So I put five from this side and four from this side. So that's a total of $9. And you guys, this little card is pretty good because it's going to save 220 on this side and 105 on this side. That will be $325 that I can use towards, you know, little expenses that I have on our vacation. So I think this is a good idea. All right. So right now it has 5, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. There's a long way to go, but don't worry. Baby steps add up. All right. So I think that's everything. There's nothing left in the cash tray for us to stuff. I really appreciate my sister for, you know, putting in on those tires and giving me that cash because look, she didn't have to, but you know what? She loves me and I love her too. And I'm so appreciative for her to give it back to me because it, it just, you know, cut down some of those costs. Those tires were expensive. I think like $700 I paid for four tires. That's insane. Okay, so for her to give me back $250 towards that and she only had the car for, you know, some months, that was very, very nice of her. So anyway, let's see. If you made it all the way to the end of this video, go ahead and put this one single emoji right here. Let me know you made it. Don't forget to also comment the hashtag that's embedded somewhere within the video so you could possibly win the two items out of my Etsy store. Um, let's see. 
if you're not subscribed, go ahead and subscribe to the video and hit the notification bell so you'll be notified the next time I put out a video, which by the way, it'll be tomorrow. Okay, because we still in the 12 days of Vlogmas. <laughs> And then also like the video because it helps it be, to be suggested to other people who might need the information. Share the video with someone if you think that they would like to be inspired to save more money in the new year. And I think that's everything, you guys. It has been so good to see you guys every day. I'm not going to lie. Some days there's a little bit of pressure for me and it'll be in the evening by the time I'm recording and I upload it kind of late. But you know what? You guys make it so worth it for me. Showing up, commenting, singing the 12 Days of Christmas songs, like cheering me on in the comment section. It's just so appreciated. You guys are just pure love. So yeah, anyway, I will see you guys very shortly for tonight. Take care.